Lake Lanier has gotten so low, only two Public Corps of Engineers boat ramps still are open, one on each side of the lake. Now the Corps of Engineers tells Channel 2 Action News those two ramps may be out of usable water around Christmas. Some lake users are trying to keep access to the lake open, as Jeff Dorr tells us live from Tidwell Park in Forsyth County. Jeff. Well, Monica, one by one at uh, boat ramps around Lake Lanier, these signs are going up. That is bad news for fishermen and the businesses that depend on them. The bait fish are some of the products that keep Hammond's fishing store going. The short supply of customers during this drought have a key question these days. What's the latest on uh, Tidwell? Still open? That's the ramp at Tidwell Park, one of only two public Corps of Engineer boat ramps still open on all of Lake Lanier. It's the only one on the Forsyth County side. Their life expectancy now is nearly as short as the bait fish. Well, if the lake continues to drop, it could be another week or two. We're kind of going day by day. Could be sooner. Being near the only open core ramp in Forsyth County has kept Hammonds going. You're near the only ramp on this side of the lake. Yes, that's correct. That is good for us, but when that ramp goes, it'll be over. So Hammonds is coordinating a fundraising effort supported by fishermen and fishing guides to extend the ramp at Charleston Park. John, this, this reading is uh, seven plus one. Viking Concrete put a surveyor in the water to see how far a ramp could go. They plan to block out the water with a temporary dam to pour concrete and add 10 more feet of depth to the ramp. Fishing guides and fishing clubs are raising the money. Anything to get on the water. They say they'll need $28,000 to extend that ramp up there at Charleston Park, all of it from private donations. We're live at Tidwell Park in the Forsyth County side of Lake Lanier. Jeff Doerr, Channel 2 Action News.